Hey everyone, it's Chris Bombano back live on the ESGI Facebook. I haven't seen you guys since the summer, but now I'm back in school and coming to you live from my classroom with some awesome new back to school promotions from ESGI. If you haven't signed up from your free trial to ESGI yet, now is your chance to do it going back to school, getting those pre-assessments in, getting that parent communication in, and most of all, saving you time in your classroom. So I'm gonna tell you how some of the teachers in my school, some of my friends I have here with me today, are using ESGI for back to school and why you should download, sign up for your free trial and start using it in your classroom right now. So first up, I have my friend Brandy Marshall. Hello, Brandy. Hello. We're gonna try to both fit in the camera, here we go. Brandy was my intern last year in my first grade classroom, and she got hired at her school as a first grade teacher. So she just finished her first full week of as a teacher, first year teacher. How are you feeling? Are you exhausted? Exhausted. Exhausted. I know the feeling. <laughs> I am too, and it's not my first year teaching, but I'm exhausted, a lot going on. But she used ESGI in her classroom this week, and I want her to share how it saved her time, how she used it the first week to get to know her students and where they're at on assessments. So you can use it in your classroom as well. So why don't you tell them how you use ESGI this week and what you loved about it so far. So what I've loved so far is just how much time it's saved. Um, every day this week I've come into Chris's room almost in tears about assessments because there's so much to do and just trying to group your kids and figure out where they are. Um, but I used ESGI for sight words and it was so simple, just created my own tests, typed in the words, and then on the computer, just, I finished my sight word testing in three days with all of my kids, which is unheard of. She usually. literally ran up to me and was like, I finished all my assessments in the first in the first week of school. While the other first grade teachers who have been teaching for a while, a lot of them are not even halfway done. They're going to be working on it next week. They have like all of these papers. And first year teacher right here using ESGI was able to finish all her back to school assessments in the first week of school, which is amazing. So now she can see where her kids are at and move on for there and get teaching. So tell them about, I know today you sent home something to the parents from ESGI. So tell them a little bit about that and um, what you did today. So I have a great group of parents this year. They've all already reached out to me trying to figure out what they can do to help their child. So today, after I had finished all of my assessments, I went on ESGI and they have parent letters that you can send home and it's so simple. So it literally, tells explains to the parents what I did with them and then it breaks down the test into what the kids got correct so which sight words they know which sight words they don't know and then you're also able to print out flashcards which I sent home to, for practice and I sent it home today after school already I've gotten emails thanking me for having it set, and they said that they were gonna work with them this weekend with it. And that's automatically generated. So Brandy created her own yes. test custom with her sight words yes. that she wanted to test them on, but there's already so many tests in there as well if you're looking to just get started right away. There's pre-made tests from all your favorite friends of ESGI for kindergarten, pre-K, you can use it for RTI, for your ESOL students, first grade students to test those sight words. They're already pre-made for you, so all you do is add that test. And then once you're finished testing, you can generate that parent letter like Brandy did and print those flashcards to send home as well. So it's super awesome. Congratulations on finishing your first week Thank of school. You. Thank and you. I'm excited for you guys to keep up with what Brandy's doing in her classroom by following me on my blog and how she uses ESGI throughout the year. So thank you, Brandy. You're welcome. So if you're not convinced already to use ESGI, I have another teacher here with you. My friend Melanie's here. Melanie is a veteran kindergarten teacher. So hi, Melanie. Hi. Melanie's been using ESGI for a few years now. And Melanie, I just want you to talk about how your classroom was pre-ESGI and then what you're doing now and how it's just changed how you assess your students, group your students, and how you work with your team. Well, you know, in kindergarten, it's really... Um busy and the kids are all doing something it's so much easier to call them up they sit with basically it's computer. a hot mess is what she's saying yeah. for the first week of school that's what she's saying absolutely yeah. <laughs> but i can call we can go sit anywhere in the room just uh, and the students can come to me they look at the computer they tell me yes or no uh, you know or they tell me what's on the screen i click yes or no and then all of a sudden I have all this data for the students and I'm able to use those parent letters just like Brandy and send it and communicate with those parents. Um, I love that as a team that we create um, assessments 
that go with our district and then we can share them amongst the team. You can search for assessments created by teachers in your district and we share those and then we're all on the same page with all our data when we have to have data meetings and we go in front of administration and we have everything is the same. We look so awesome. Administration loves ESGI data because the graphs are all right there. It can tell you how to group your kids. You can click on how many got this incorrect, how many got this correct. And if you're planning intervention as a team, like Melanie said, it's awesome to kind of quickly do that and save a lot of time with your grouping of students as well. Absolutely. Awesome. So thank, thank you, you, Melanie. So if Brandy and Melanie haven't convinced you already, ESGI has a really cool back to school promotion going on right now that I want you to to know about. So all your friends of ESGI, if you check out their blogs, you can visit it through the ESGI blog on ESGI social media. They've been talking about how they use ESGI in their classroom. If you sign up before the end of September, you can not only get your free 60 days of ESGI, but you get $40 off a license and you're entered to win one of 10 different $50 TPT gift certificates if you sign up right now. So visit your favorite friend of ESGI's blog, there's all over social media from ESGI. If you go to the ESGI website or blog, they're on there as well. Use that promo code to sign up for your free trial. Start with your assessments right away, and you'll be entered to win one of those $10, $50 gift certificates if you sign up by September 30th. So this is just for back to school. Anyone who signs up with one of those promo codes from one of your friends of ESGI will be entered to win that awesome prize. So I hope you loved hearing from Brandy and Melanie about how they use ESGI in their classroom and how it saved them tons of hours this first week of school. And I hope you decide to sign up for ESGI right now. So after this video, go over, sign up, use that promo code and sign up for ESGI to save your time in your classroom for back to school. I hope you all have an awesome first week back to school and good luck with ESGI. I'll talk to you all soon.